Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Um, today I wanted to share some exciting news and um, guess what? I receive the rest of my Alex unit. So I got this tall one right here from Ikea. And I think you guys saw the video for this one. And then, oh, look at my early Christmas gift from my husband because I really needed it. This is the LED UV lamp. And it's by um, Sunroof. I think that's how you say it. Let me tell you guys, I love it. It works. Awesome, awesome investment. Let me tell you. It's beautiful and it has, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it has the 10 second, 30 second, 60 second, and 90 second um, curing light. All right, I got two of them. So I'm so happy. All right. And then also he got me this LED lamp which um, we got it at the nail supply store club close by me and we were able to hook it up right here which is awesome as you can see I love it that's my early Christmas gift I thank him so much because I really needed it but anyway I wanted to show you here's the other unit I just needed two more so this is the other one that goes on the side of my nail desk and I know you guys can relate this cord issues that we deal with all the time. I cannot stand it, but sorry, I'm in my slippers. <laughs> but anyway, I wanted to show you where, what I'm storing in here. Storing all my nail supplies, okay? So this first one here is where I'm storing like the acrylics that I made with glitter. This is when I first started. I still got them. I got to do something with them. Here are a bunch of glitters that I have that didn't fit in my glitter drawer. So I have to make room for these. So I have them for right now. I have them here. And then here are all my um, orders that I received from eBay. You know, all that is in there. I'll show it to you. If I have some time to show it to you be before this video ends, I will show it to you. Okay, the next drawer I have here are all my nail art. Well, some of it because some most of it didn't fit. But um, I think this is where I store all my nail art. Take a quick look. This is all my nail art. Alloys, stones. This is mostly my alloys, and then this one has a mixture of alloys and resins. And then here I have a bunch of ones that I've purchased that I shoved them here on the side that I haven't even organized. So they're right here sitting on the side, which I will eventually put away as you can see. <laughs> All right, so this is where I'm storing my nail art for right now this next drawer is where I have my appointment book my nail tips extra nail tips here and these um, for nail art and my practice fingers and more tips back there so I have the natural the clear stilettos and the clear squares and the white squares okay okay and the next drawer I have here I had to remove my gel polishes from here because for some reason they were drying up I lost like maybe four or five of them so I was so disappointed I had to reorder but anyway these are all my gel polishes I have them here I got like the blues like the the golds and you know all the brown shades and then the purples and then I have the reds, uh, all shades of reds, um, magenta, you know, like that. And then here are more. And then these are right here are my latest ones that I've gotten. So I put them here in the front so it'll be easier for me to find them. And then 
I have more here. And here are my lights. All my light color gels, so I put them here. I ordered some more, so at least I have room to put them in there. All right, and then in the next drawer I have here is all my empty containers, my round um, sample tips for swatching. I have them in the natural and the clear. And then these are for my acrylic collections for like um, fantasy nails or any type of collections I get in acrylics. Then I have back here, I have like empty jars. So I keep them back there. See more. Um, here I got empty little jars. And these are for the polishes, gel polishes, the sample tips. Um, and more empty containers, as you can see, a sharpener. And then the next one down here, I have my notebooks with all my um, followers and my nail buddies uh, information from the ones that I joined in my group swaps. And for group swaps I have joined, I like to keep them so I can send them for mail or anything like that. So here I have like my chalks, my makeup to make, you know, acrylics, chalk pigments. I have tool here, more um, like sh eyeshadow that I got from the dollar store, LA colors, I, use, I make acrylics with them, and the sponges, nickel sponges, and I got some acrylics that I made already here, and this is some clear gel that I ordered, this is the base one clear gel, the builder gel. And then down here, I have more glitter mixes. Guys, you know, I told you I have still tons and tons that I have to put in those clear contain cases with the jars in it that I bought at Michael's. And these are my, my um, nail art paint that I bought from Michael's, like um, Craft Smart. Uh, I have some other ones here. What is this one called? Crafters Edition. They're acrylic paints. Um, what a bunch of them. And this one is um, the Apple Barrel colors also. So that's what's in this drawer. And then my last drawer is all like my baggies and my cotton rounds, my, my wipes, my nail wipes stuff like that I keep down here so that's what I made use of this organizer and I'll show you this one again here I have all my organic nail collection which I love 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 um, they're I love it. these are my babies love it love it love it Okay, so these are all my organic nail collections. And then the next drawer I have here is my color acrylics, and my pigments. Okay, so I have them here. The next drawer I have here, these are glitter mixes that I have already mixed with clear acrylic. So that way, if a client wants to get some glitter mixes, Usually I have them here swatched so they can pick it from there and I'll find it here and I just do the nails. They're already prepped with um, clear acrylic. Alright and then here's some more. And then here I have all my fantasy nails collections. Um, I have two more that I have to get that I'm waiting for. I should get it after the holidays. I'm in no rush, so just like the new one um, called Beautiful. Can't wait to get that one. And then my last drawer here is all my glitter mixes. I think you guys seen this. I think this is where I keep them. And you saw the tons of bags that I still have to sort. So this is where I'm going to be putting them at. i got to get more cases like this. 
and this is how I organize them. Sorry, it's a little dark. All right. And then we're going to go walk over here. This is my nail drill. Love it. All right. And this is where I disinfect my implements, sanitize them. Uh, my nail fan. And here I have... Kind of organized, guys. Kind of organized. I try, but when you have clients and you're looking for stuff, <laughs> it becomes a mess. Here, this drawer right here is all my stamping stuff. I have my stamping books. Remember, I didn't have these. I finally got them. I bought some from Nails by um, Jen's Nail World. Um, I got the stamping plate bundle, and it came with a book and. So some um, came with the stamping place. Some I just added some of mine. So I have a bunch. My collection is starting to get bigger. I'm excited. I don't know if you can see. Sorry. But I'll show you more deeper in another video. If you guys want to see my plates, message me down below. I mean, comment down below and let me know. So I'll take my time and show you. Um, but I got more here. Got this little one back here. We got plates in there. More over there. And my paint um, palette. Here are some swatch tips that I did. I just put them in there. My stampers, my scrapers. I have them all in here. All right, my next drawer. All right, so here are all my nail arts that I have. Little rhinestones, as you can see. Nail art, striping tape, stones. Here are more um, alloy. And these are microbeads. Or, yeah, microbeads. resin bowls there's more nail art this is all nail art and here are my Savorsky crystals with my wax pencil which actually guys these are great I love it I was using like um my orange wood stick you know and dipping it into a little bit of the gel and that's how I was doing it but when I got this this was only 99 cents best investment <laughs> I ordered some more to have and I have the little triangle trays here for the crystals and the glitters when you do sugar nails okay and then here are my files my face masks my forms my buffers these are all new right here i don't know if you can see because my lighting is not that great but this is where i keep all my buffers and files all new ones my glue my forms and these are sandy bits and my nail extra nail brushes and these are the sanding bands the fine and the coarse and the medium and my drill bits right here my finger protector so yeah that's how I organize it this is my miscellaneous stuff so basically here are all my clients files and buffers I got them with their names all here and then here I have all my nail art stickers as you can see because they were like everywhere at one point in the other cart so, and then these are more stickers. And then here is my um, stamping mat. I haven't used it yet. I have to try it. And then my last drawer down here, I have my towels. These are all towels. I keep them there. This is my little nail corner. I'm going to give you Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you like this video. Please comment, subscribe, and like. And I'll catch you guys on my next one.